Hi guys, just a wee quick one. Uh, this is another mass airflow video. Uh, this one here is a four wire sensor. Uh, it is a hot film, but it has a frequency output. So there's no five volts into there. That one there is the IAT thicker wire on the white. It's a 12 volt. Blue one's ground and the yellow's a signal light. But this will be a frequency signal. So let me just show, show you the output of that. The reason why we're interested in this is because our uh, fuel trims are always negative. So negative fuel trims, and it's not reading uh, exceptionally high. So it's very subtle. There's no real drivability issues, and it's not flagging a, an engine management light or anything like that. So we do suspect them off. Uh, sometimes the short-term fuel term goes as much as minus 10. It's not doing it just at the minute but certainly the long term sitting at minus 10. So negative fuel trims, just back them off. Right, so we've uh, put a new MOS sensor in there, uh, or digital type, and uh, we're gonna look at the trims here. So, we're gonna look at the trims here, and uh, you can see our long term coming away down. It was sitting at minus 10. So what we noticed was the short term was going positive and that was bringing the long term down. So very, very subtle difference. The flow rates, very, very uh, smaller. Uh, the original sensor was reading about 1.98 and that's now reading 1.86 grams per second, 1.83. This is at idle. And uh, it just takes away, it'll probably need to take us go out for a drive uh, to get that down to near enough zero on, on both uh, trims there but I think what was happening here with this one whenever the car was uh, driven for a while uh, the sensor was getting sort of heat soaked so whenever it was warm uh, she was sitting at minus 10 minus 10 short term minus 10 long term and uh, I was stuck a new mass at MAF in it there and uh, the short terms went positive and uh, that brought the long term down fairly instantaneously and very very uh, subtle difference with the flow rate but I'll just uh, this is a, a digital type sensor we'll maybe just do a wee, couple of wee frequency tests okay uh, that's us hooked into our signal output there and we've hooked up the the mixing this is just for a demonstration of uh, a frequency output on a mass sensor, so uh, we'll put you in view there, and uh, I'll give it a couple of revs here, just so you can see the, you can see a change. Okay, so that's a digital four-wire sensor uh, from a Ford. It's a Ford engine that's in this uh, Volvo. So, thanks again for watching, and all the best. Bye-bye.